Hello, my name's Adam Smith Connor. I'm director here at New Forest Physiotherapy Clinic, Southampton. We've been established uh, since September 2007. We set up over in uh, Gangwarali, and we've also got another clinic where I am right now in Solar Business Centre in Southampton that started in June 2012. We provide physiotherapy services to the local population here. But I just wanted to let you know a little bit about my background and the story of New Forest Physiotherapy Clinic and why we exist. So I qualified in Birmingham University back in 1994 and since then uh, I've worked for the NHS in the private health sector and also for the MOD, primarily for the Army, but I have also worked for the Navy as well. And over those years, I've, I've noticed there's certain things within each system that I've worked in that has its own limitations, and also things that are really very good within the certain systems. So the NHS, where I first started, excellent insofar as the treatment is free at the point of usage. However, I found it to be very limited because the waiting times would, would be so long, up to six months, that by the time I saw people, their conditions were really very chronic, and it meant that they really needed an awful lot of input in order to correct, correct the problem. However, I couldn't give them an awful lot of input. I would have 20 minute sessions, it was limited how many times I could see people, uh, a lot of it was home exercises and self-management. The amount of manual hands-on treatment that I could provide was limited. And this made it a bit frustrating as a, as a job because you felt I, was doing, I felt I was doing half treatment so I couldn't really get my teeth into people. After the NHS I, w I worked for the private health sector, so working for, for Bupa uh, primarily. And this was a better system insofar as waiting times are a lot less. You could be in within a week. Um, disadvantage, obviously, you have to pay f pay for that system. And also another disadvantage is you a little bit at the whim of your policy. So your policy might allow you uh, five sessions, or there may be a, an excess. So you could be limited on the number of sessions that you could have. Um, but overall, I, it, it was certainly an improvement on the kind of waiting times that I used to find within the NHS. But by far the best system that I've worked in is, is the MOD. Now, the MOD, the stress on the MOD is very different to that of Bupa and the NHS. Within Bupa and the NHS, physiotherapy was kind of seen as a cost, as an expense. Whereas within the MOD, they recognise that it's actually saving them money. Because if a soldier is in Afghanistan, or, well, not, we're not in Afghanistan anymore, but is in an operational theatre and they get an injury, that could potentially send them back to the UK. Well, if you've got physiotherapists on site that can keep you in theatre and return you back to your role in theatre, then you're saving yourself an awful lot of money. And this is what I did when I was in Afghanistan in, back in 2007. But I've also worked at training units, and in, in training units, your uh, recruits, they're on strict systems of training, and if, if they get an injury, which means they can't finish that training, then again, it costs the military an awful lot of money. So they invest well in their uh, physiotherapy cover. I could see people every day if, if necessary and really get my teeth into them. The gym facilities are generally very good. Now when I, when I was in Afghanistan in 2007 I had time to think about what I was going to do when I got back. And I decided that I would set up my own clinic, my own physiotherapy clinic. Which as I said earlier, I did do in September 2007. And I wanted to be able to provide people top quality 
physiotherapy treatment, which would get people to achieve or help people to achieve their physical goals and get them back to the kind of fitness that they wanted, not what the system was able to provide for them. So what I mean by that is within the NHS I could get people up and running, you know, I could sorry, not running, I could get people up and functioning. So I could have them um, walking. But if you're a runner, that's not really good enough. You want to be back and running. And by setting up my own clinic, I have that ability. I can get people back to full fitness and beyond full fitness. And um, our um, strap line is beyond your best. Our aim is to have you educated, and fit and strong. So that by the time you've finished a course of treatment with us, you are fitter and better and more capable than you were even prior to your injury. We have complete care. We've got links with local surgeons and local GPs. So on the rare occasion that our physio care is unable to help you, we can refer you on to um, surgeons who can do MRI scans, ultrasound scans, and we, we do have strong links with them, so that, that's not a problem. If we need to refer you on, we can do that. And I believe that we provide an excellent service, and I'm prepared to put my name to that. And if anyone who comes to us doesn't feel that they are completely satisfied with the care that they receive from us, I have a 100% money back guarantee. I'm confident that once you come to us, we can make a, a big impact on your condition. And if we can't cure it, we can refer you on to the people who can. So, if you'd like to come and see us and experience the New Forest Physio Southampton treatment package, then our phone number is 023 8008 And we'd love to see you, we'd love to help you and work with you and uh, get you back achieving your physical goals, whatever that may be for you. Thank you for listening.